Hey folks, Ira here. I hope you've had a great Monday. Thanks for tuning in for the Earthquake Report. Today is June the 6th, 2016. It was on this day in 1994 when a 6.8 struck Columbia. At least 295 people were killed, 500 missing, 13,000 homeless, and severe damage was caused to houses, highways, and bridges by the earthquake and ensuing landslides. Today is known as National Gardening Exercise and National Yo-Yo Day. Not to be left out, today is a time of fasting, worship, and renewal of family ties. That's right, today is Ramadan. Also on this day in the year 2007, Activision released Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare for the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360. God, that was a great game. All right, earthquake report time, here we go. As of 6.51 p.m. Eastern Time, we have clocked in 190 earthquakes. That brings our weekly total to 574 and our monthly total to 1,273. For historical reference, a year ago today, we clocked in 243 earthquakes. The strongest to strike the planet then was a 5.5 that struck Indonesia. As it stands now, we have registered one earthquake that fell within the magnitude 6 scale. This was a 6.4, which was later revised to a 6.0 that struck New Zealand. This powerful earthquake struck on Monday morning about 80 miles southeast of New Zealand's remote Kermodic Islands in the South Pacific. We have experienced two magnitude 5 earthquakes, both of which struck Chile. These were a 5.4 and a 5.3. We have clocked in 16 magnitude 4 earthquakes, 5 of which struck South America. This includes Chile, once again with a 4.3 and a 4.1, Peru with a 4.4, Ecuador with a 4.5, and Venezuela with a 4.5. In Central America, we experienced a 4.6 and a 4.3 in Mexico, and Guatemala with a 4.3. We also experienced an unusual earthquake in Panama, this was a 4.6. Across the Pacific, we see that Japan was hit with a 4.5 and a 4.3, Fiji with a 4.5, the Philippines with a 4.8, Indonesia with a 4.9, and finally Cyprus with a 4.2. The remaining earthquakes struck various locations here in the United States. We see that Hawaii has registered 6 thus far. The average magnitude was only a 1.5, The strongest to hit was a 2.9 at the volcano. Alaska has experienced 37. The most intense to be registered today was a 3.9 in Nikolsky. Washington has clocked in 14. 79% of these quakes hit Bridgeport. The strongest experience also originated from this area. This was a 1.6. Interesting. Oregon has logged 2. These were a 1.5 in Grand Ronde and a 0.8 in Lakeview. California has experienced 65 earthquakes thus far. The most intense to strike was a 2.2 in Yosemite Valley. The earthquake swarms were limited to the usual locations. This includes the geysers with 16 and Cobb with 4. Nevada has experienced 20 today. The strongest to strike was a 1.7 in Alamo. 55% of the earthquakes experienced in Nevada were experienced there. Utah remains quiet. In Montana, it is a completely different story altogether. We have Register 9 there, the strongest being a 1.7 in Butte. This is an increase of over 89% from what was experienced there yesterday. Wyoming has seen 2, the strongest being a 0.7 in Jackson. Oklahoma has clocked in 5, two of which originated from Pawnee, These were both 3.6s. We have also experienced a 3.5 in Jones, a 2.9 in Enid, and a 2.5 in Medford. The New Madrid Seismic Fault experienced movement today, this being a 2.3 that hit steel. Finally, the eastern limb of the North American Craton has been quiet. No earthquakes to report along the east coast at this time. So, there you have it folks. This has been a considerably more active day than what we witnessed recently. What is interesting is the movement we experienced has been limited to a few locations. Based off the data, we've seen substantial seismic activity spanning the globe. Interesting indeed. And 
And that is it for the Earthquake Report. If you experienced an earthquake today, or if you would simply like to chat, please post down below. I'd like to hear from you. Make certain to like and subscribe. Also, if you like the social media thing, you can link to us via the standard allotted social sites in the description. Guys, stay safe. Have a great night. Hoorah!